And I'm back right after recording the first episode. I was just starting to make the next one. Um, last time we have made our first attempt at doing Pluto. I have changed up two decks. I have uh, changed up Esther for the funny sort of volition deck, which funnily enough was my first thought when I heard, hey, I have to, I have to actually use all that all light. I hope this counts. If it doesn't count, back to the drawing board. Next up we've got John and John is basically, I, I hope this counts again. And let's hear again, it's uh, back to the drawing board. But this is the singular, the, the only one attack. This is the use or light and everything else can be distributed on the other three. Let's go. And again, we try as hard as possible to to make sure that um, we get the emotion coins we need. Okay, you're currently on PT. I want you uh, on slash. I want you on guard. We cannot deal damage to him anyway. Whereas the only one offensive page. Hey, he already knows who he's supposed to attack. I put Grace the Grass on here mainly because it only it's a light restore with only one. Offensive die. For first turn, you two can just draw pages. I kind of want this here. Certain cost gain power others lose could go here. I'm gonna make sure that I actually get stuff. Actually, I want you to, to get the swiftness. So you want to clash anyway. Since you're going to be blocking most of the time. Then... You take the randomized costs. And you take whatever this is. Page with a certain cost gain power, however, lose power. Let's go. Yeah, Hawkmas not getting an emotion coin, which is very sad. Okay, and now everything is just easy. Okay, you cannot use one cost, but funnily enough, you don't have any. Also, you only have two light because our first turn was shit. Um... I want you to go here. This is not a really big problem. But since it's block dice, this could actually work. And as long as you always clash, we don't have a problem. You have to use all light, so you go here. 
Actually, you can use that on here. You can use the Sword of Volition literally anywhere else. You have to what? Okay, two costs gain free power, everything else loses free power. Obviously, how? Uh, what else should it be? We do not get the right cards. So we use a one side attack here. It's better to not play any cards here. As much as it sucks, but we lose less if we do that. It worked, it worked, it worked. That's good, that's good, that's good. Oh, apparently it didn't work. Oh, come on. Really? So as lo I, I cannot even restore l light during the scene, so I have to find another way to use all my light. God damn it. So the Sword of Volition Strike doesn't work, this means this character will die this scene. There's no reason to clash, is there? You can just attack literally anyone in a one-sided attack. You will now use free costs, eh? Good thing we get exactly one free cost here. That is also a very annoying uh, contract, not gonna lie. What's yours again? Really, zero costs have gained power. Okay, you get strength and you get, uh, you're not getting it, you get strength too. Great, a stagger. That's what I needed. Yeah, I would have been surprised. I will not win a singular clash of his entire turn, will I? One is down. Two are down.
Basically, three are down and we're still against four, five enemies. Oh great, one costs are gaining strength this time. None of these are great, but I suppose Penance is the best one. That's actually helpful. Now I cannot use penance anymore, but <gasps> whatever. Okay. So the funny thing is I could technically still win if I play this absolutely smart. Ah shit, I don't have enough charge. Uh we do this one. Okay, we do get a stagger. That's not good. Right, they're all useless. They're literally all useless.
And I lose again. Yeah, I actually hate this fight. I... I have no idea how I'm supposed to do this. Absolutely no idea. I need to find a whole other way to get one person to use all the light without restoring any, apparently. Which already is really fucky. One other thing I could do is to put uh, both of the annoying things on one person and just make, or other, I could put, yeah, I could put two annoying contracts on one person, maybe more. And uh, have the four other people be actually good. Uh, this is, this is all annoying. Everything about this is annoying. I. I, oh god. I have no idea how to tackle this. Absolutely no idea how to tackle this. I am absolutely stunned. And I'm pretty sure that this did not, actually, yeah, this did work or this didn't work? I, I will have to recheck the video to see if this worked or if, uh, or if John was staggered after using Burning Flash. So if that happened, then this is also useless. And I will have to stack three pages on one person. Did we use Eugene here? Ooh, we didn't. Okay. There is a way I can stack three pages on uh, three of the bad contracts on one person if I use Eugene's speed two on a throwaway page. But also, uh, if I give that page, like, all the bad pages, like, just something like Dodge and Strike or Gather Intel, we can also make sure that the Eugene, uh, the, the Eugene Attributor page dies first. And has very low stats. So it doesn't really affect the battle that much, apart from taking the bad contracts off of me. Oh my god. This will take a lot more thinking than I'm prepared for. So, uh, yeah. I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. I will have to go back to the drawing board and try again once I'm thoroughly prepared. Usually I would use the same build and try again. But right here, for this fight, I need to have one build. One will build that works against this specific fight. This fight requires you to actually have specific builds. I dislike that at some uh, to some degree. I do like that to some other degree, but I might also have to change Hawkma's uh, block page. To actually not use the overcharge combo so much, but uh, more rely on blocks. But yeah, that's, uh, that's something I'm gonna tackle once I get there. But yeah, I need way more preparation for this. And yeah, sorry for the short episode, but I hope you see you guys again in the next one. Bye-bye.